Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you how to fix Magic the Gathering Arena Network error in Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to troubleshoot the internet connections. To do this, press the Windows button then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure system is selected on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the troubleshoot category and click on it. Now in here select other troubleshooters and afterwards click on the run button next to internet connections. Now Windows will try to find the best possible fixes for your issues. Afterwards you can restart your PC and check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to temporarily disable your firewall. To do this press the Windows button then simply type firewall and then select Windows Defender Firewall from the search results. In here on the left pane select the turn Windows Defender Firewall on or off option and afterwards both on private network settings and public network settings click on the turn off option. You can now click on the OK button to save the changes and restart your PC and check if the problem still persists. Another useful solution is to repair or reset the application. To do this press the Windows button then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on apps on the left pane and then on the right side click on apps and features. Personally I do not own the game but the example that I'll show you is exactly the same. So scroll down until you find Magic the Gathering then click on the ellipsis next to it and select advanced options. Now in here scroll down until you find the reset section and you can start by clicking on the repair button. In this case the app's data won't be affected at all. But if this step doesn't prove useful, you can also reset the app. In this case the app's data will be deleted and everything will return to the default state. You can then restart your PC and check if the issue still persists. And lastly another great solution is to flush the DNS cache. To do this press the Windows button then simply type CMD and then run command prompt as an administrator. Now in here simply type the following command and then press enter after this command. Now the last thing you have to do is simply close this window, restart your PC and then check if the problem still persists. And that's it. Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.